Dr. Jane Goodall, considered to be one of the world's most foremost experts on chimpanzees, paid a visit to Kern County tonight. And 23 ABC's Carlos Correa sat down with the famous primatologist to talk about her career, her passion, and her new book, released today. Technology has changed dramatically since Dr. Jane Goodall started studying chimpanzees more than 50 years ago. I started with a pen and a notepad and a pair of old secondhand binoculars. And I did my analysis with a slide rule. Most people don't even know what that is anymore. Now, her work includes Google Earth, Digital Globe, and even NASA helps create detailed maps to not only identify the range of the chimps more accurately, but to protect them. It's in real time. So if they find an illegal tree cut down or an illegal poaching, the little flash goes up to the clouds and it's available all over the world. Goodall uses social media to connect with fans and uses it to inspire a new generation who often end up teaching her a thing or two. It was pretty fantastic uh, getting a selfie of Jane Goodall because uh, I formulated, formulated a lot of majors, but uh, anthropology obviously being notable and you know just seeing uh, Jane Goodall is ubiquitous with anthropology. and so. It's kind of cool to actually, you know, meet the individual and get a selfie. I'm a baby boomer, a great admirer of Dr. Goodall's work, and we brought the shirts to have a picture with Dr. Goodall because this is my father's prized possession from her institute. Through the Jane Goodall Institute, she brings young people from more than 130 countries together to learn about environmental, conservation, and humanitarian issues. What I love best is that children who write to me from all over the world and say, you've taught me that because you did it, I can do it too. I love that. And, you know, getting them all involved, hands-on, on projects to help people, animals, and the environment. In Bakersfield, Carlos Correa, 23 ABC.